How should I deal with folks who sympathize with me for having two daughters? I constantly hear things like. Third time is the charm. You should try for a boy. Every man needs a son. Keep trying, but with your luck you might have with another girl. It's okay, girls can be fun too. Are you going to try for a boy? Lucky you don't have to worry about their career because they can just marry rich. You need to be more careful because they are girls. After gender testing we told a family member that it is a girl. She responded saying there is still hope. These tests are like only 95 accurate. I rebelled against such statements previously and someone was like of course you would say that because you have girls I rolled my eyes and bowed out of that conversation. How do you think I should handle such comments? I'm the third of three girls and I know that at some point my parents thought it would have been great to experience having a boy as well as girls, but it was fleeting. We had a great family dynamic and wouldn't change a thing. You can't change others' minds about this, just focus on what makes your family awesome and then you will come off as confident and maybe even lucky. This bias is real on the other side too, I have many friends with only boys and they get very loud, resounding ohnos and you poor thing on the regular. I'm one of five daughters. When people said to my father, didn't you want a son? He replied, yes, but I wouldn't trade one of my girls for one. Why is it so important to you that we have a boy? I mean, you seem to care an awful lot about it. Does having a family of girls bother you? After having a daughter, an old lady asked me when I was having another baby, specifically saying don't you want to try for a boy? I said shit Bev, they're babies, not baseball cards. Tell them to fuck off. I have had two daughters for over a decade, and I have literally never heard a comment like that. I think you probably just need to hang around with a better class of people. I would ask, with genuine interest, why this person feels that males are intrinsically better than females. I have two girls and have heard similar comments. My response has been. Why? I'm not a medieval lord who needs an heir. Girls are awesome. What could I do with a son that I can't do with my daughter? Wow, I'm sure you didn't mean to say something so sexist misogynistic. Wow, I didn't know my child's gender meant so much to you. Even something like wow, what do you mean by that? Can help someone see how ridiculous what they're saying is. I have four grown. Back in the day when someone said you need to try one more time for a boy I'd just, I want another girl dot I'm trying for a basketball team. My dad had two daughters and from what I can tell, he preferred it to having a son or two. Some men are meant to be girl dads. Just be a good dad to your daughters. Who gives a fuck what other people say? Wow, I'm assuming you didn't mean to sound like an asshole, but I'm very happy with my child regardless of gender. People suck. I'm sorry. I'm happy with my healthy children, a blessing denied to many. I've seen people say the opposite to moms with all boys. It seems that people want to see a balance in the force, girls, and boys. I'm not sure why people think that their opinion on the subject is even welcome. All girls is perfect, all boys is perfect, a mix of both is perfect. I'm snarky, so my response would be the general ballpark of thank you for your opinion, I will talk to my uterus and see if it's on board to change sexes if a girl is detected, just for you. I'm one of six girls. The first thing people say when they find out is wow, your poor dad. On the flip side, my sister has four sons. She's pregnant with a girl. She is already dreading all the oh you finally got your daughter, you can stop trying comments. People suck and project their own desires on others. Wow what a bunch of but holes. I would say something like why are you so obsessed with my children's genitals? I cut these people out my life faster than you'd think. As a woman myself, this is just horribly rude and sexist to say. There is still hope. I'd let them explain to me why I'd need more hope. 
In every detail, over and over oh no could you explain more I still don't get it, until they realize what kind of shit thing this is to say. I always think a good response to stuff like this would be, what? Are my daughters not enough? I'm sure they'll love that. Oh, we're gonna abort the fuck out of the next one if it's a girl, believe me. That should shut them up. My favorite way to respond to these types of questions is just ask the person what they mean by the comment, force them to explain their position. Most of the time they will end up feeling awkward when trying to respond and maybe it'll get them to stop doing that in the future. I use the same method when somebody makes a joke that is casually homophobic or racist. My son is 11. I constantly got when are you going to try for a girl? I wasn't. I was happy with him. I didn't feel like there was some hole missing because I didn't have both genders. When I got pregnant with my daughter seven years after my son, it was lots of nods of approval. All right, you did it it's just annoying. And I ignore it. Neither of my kids were planned and I would have been just as happy with two boys or two girls. Who do you hang around with that says lucky you for having girls, you don't have to worry about an education. Just marry them off rich where on earth do you live that this is a normal thing to say. Just curious. That's awful. I'm sorry you have to deal with that rampant misogyny. It could probably be taxing to push back, but that sort of garbage is worth pushing back on. So yeah, as much as you have the energy to, you should rebut that BS. Particularly as you have daughters, you don't want sexist attitudes around them. Better to TRYN nudge those around you who may receptive to listen to. Not being sexists? It's a tough ask for sure. You should respond with what the fuck is wrong with you. Stare at them for a couple of seconds while they try to respond and then walk away. Why would I need another dick in my family when I have you as a friend? Girls are the best and having daughters changes a man in a good way. I was happy to have a second after meeting the first and then went straight for a vasectomy. Play a little naive and prompt them to explain themselves. What do you mean? Why would I want a boy? Really? You care about that? Make it as awkward for them as they're making it for you. Wondering what country or decade OP is posting from. Ask them to explain what they mean by it, play really dumb and keep saying what mean worse. How do you mean harder? Until they tie themselves in knots and either shit up or realize they are idiots. Or ask them why are obsessed with your child's genitalia, that's a good one when said pretty loudly and in a pretty shocked voice. Sounds like you've got some pretty awesome luck. Your children are going to love you regardless of their gender. Is this actually a thing? My wife and I were hoping our first would be a girl, but it was a boy. I'm a man and I love my son like no tomorrow, but I've always wanted a little girl more than anything. I love my daughters more than anything and didn't give two fucks about other people's opinions about me having a son when I only had them. Why do you think me having a girl is a problem? Or why do you care so much about the gender of my baby? Or I'm sure you didn't mean to sound sexist and misogynistic, right? Because that's what it sounded like. Ask them what the fuck is wrong with them. Probably not a good idea, but it feels like it would be satisfying. I have three boys, and I always get the opposite question when will you try for the girl? Answer never. We are extremely happy as we are. It's never occurred to me that having daughters isn't ideal. Why do you think it isn't? I would honest to God be very direct and just say that's a very weird thing to say. Why do you say such things? There is nothing wrong with having a girl. I'm hoping to be blessed with another one. People with daughters have longer life expectancies. Simply tell the people that say this they are misogynists. Why do you hate girls? What what you mean? You say insert what they said as if having girls is a bad thing, so I want to know why you hate girls. Put them on the spot, make them actually try to tell you why they prefer boys or think so poorly about girls. Most people will probably freeze up or stammer without actually giving an assa as in the end most of them don't want to come off as misogynists even when they are.